Welcome to Cruise Master by Vehicle Components Camper Trailer of the Year. We've brought 25 of Australia's best camper trailers to a beautiful section of northern New South Wales rainforest and recruited the country's most experienced judges to run their eyes over them. Let's see how it goes. The Australian Off-Road Quantum Plus is built tough, cool and lightweight with insulating composite panels either side of a recycled plastic core. Inside and out, it has all the features you'd expect to find in a truly self-sufficient off-road hybrid. Outside, under the 4.3 by 2.2 metre rollout awning, the Quantum Plus has an 82 litre fridge freezer with full deep storage capacity. It has a full L-shaped stainless steel kitchen with generous pantry area, but it's inside where the Quantum Plus really stands apart. The Macerator toilet has a capacity holding tank up front of 140 litres. The whole interior is fully capable of accommodating a family of five, and when you don't need the bunks, you simply flip them up to reveal a spacious lounge area. But let's see what the judges think. The Australian Off-Road Quantum was a uh, quite a large hand there, what did you think of it? Well it's even larger than the Quantum, in fact mate this is the Quantum Plus which is actually 680 mil longer than the Quantum that we've seen at this competition before and you know 680 mil is a, it, it makes this a big long unit with a whole heap of facility. It had an interesting interior configuration range in it. Yeah, it's beautiful on the inside. It's got a really nice vibe about it for sure. Really nice and airy. It's got a comfy queen in a spring bed. The, the top bunk sort of folded up so you could use the dinette area during the day, but then folded down and the dinette converted to a, a second bunk. So for a family, yeah, it was, it was ideal. In a surprising move, they've actually put their awning onto the top, top part of the roof. So when it goes right up, you've got massive windows opening all the way around and they're actually still under the awning so even with them all completely open on a stinking hot day you still get fantastic airflow through so it really lowers those internal temperatures and it's, it's really noticeable if you're going to be parked up somewhere stinking hot beach it's going to be a little little slice of heaven inside this is as, probably as big as you're going to want on a single axle uh, it's seven meters long overall and at $108,000 as we saw it, it's, it's big in price, but you get an awful lot for that. I mean, the water, for example, there's 240 litre water tanks. There's an optional third 60 litre water tank, a black water tank uh, with a macerator system. It, it, there's just everything and anything you can think of in this van. You can run your coffee machine if you want to. You can run a hairdryer if you want to. It really is a good, powerful unit with plenty of batteries I'd go anywhere in this unit. I, I think it really does suit the grey nomads of this country. But even for a young family to be touring, absolutely. It really is the Taj Mahal of camper trailers, isn't it?